We just went uh, to Washington, D.C. We just came back, and I thought it was one of the most interesting, exciting, and most productive trips I've ever had the pleasure to be associated with. The leadership program, I feel it's one of the best things that happened to me as a student in, in, at Lehman. The leadership program has impacted me so much. It's like, um, you know, I learned to be more open with um, people. I make great friends. I think the, um, the Washington experience has been like life changer, basically. The whole trip. Some moment overcame the other moment, and it just it just all ended up to just this beautiful experience. It's always awesome. I don't think I'll ever lose the awe of going to the White House and meeting the staff who work there. We had the chance to meet a sitting um, Supreme Court justice, and that is amazing. I'm a journalism major, and I connected very well, and I was very inspired by her and very motivated. Her work was inspiring, everything that she said, what she'd gone through, and also she gave, gave us a lot of hope. It was an honor, you know. You can actually say, you know, I met this person, and it, she's going to be, like, in the history books. One of the speakers we met is a brilliant lawyer who spoke to the students about uh, police brutality. We had such an authentic conversation about that, and she spoke to them not just as a lawyer, but as a mom. And um, that was really one of the highlights of the trip for me. We got to bond with Elias, um, he was great. Seeing um, Elias, who was just a normal student at Lehman, and seeing him in action with under pre working under the president just gave us a, li like, a little push that if he can be there, we can be there too. He made it up there to the White House. You come from the Bronx and be able to see it all the way to the White House, it kind of gives you hope, kind of gives you like that little like fuel to finish and to, like, to rise your determination. Elias Encantara had showed us what he does. Um, he showed us the conferences that he does as a host. They spoke about um, people who are in jail and how they can change their lives after you know, they come out of jail. There are people out there that, yeah, they've made mistakes, but like they're trying their hardest to like get back into society. And sometimes there are limitations and barriers that is th that's out of their control. I, I thought the student interaction was uh, I would I used the term magical and because they they talked to each other, they related, they supported each other. You know, when we on the way to the to the Supreme Court we get separated by the bus and, and they rallied and they get uh, taxis and we all made it on time. Wow. It was so beautiful and it was such a short amount of time. Like I didn't even expect that to happen. It was just like two days together and we just, <laughs> we became so close in so little time. I was just like, whoa, okay, wow, yeah, this is something. After we went to DC, um, our students are just like, this is not going to be the end, right? We're going to still meet to see the video and we can get popcorn, right? Um, they want to make sure that we are still together as a group. And so they have become family to us. <laughs>